So we're heading to the Christmas market now, which we're pretty excited about. It's it snowed so much today, so we've got to be a bit careful on the ground as we use this stabilizer. Uh, we found out just quickly looking, I think the Christmas market is kind of closed, <laughs> but we're hoping that it's kind of not. No, uh, we, not. It's kind of funny because it reads on the website that it's closed. Having said that, it says that the Christmas, whoa, slippering here. Slippery. It's very slippery. The Christmas drinks are still open. So at least we can get there for drinks and maybe some snacks. Um, mm. So we'll, we'll see. Hey guys. Tallinn is more beautiful than ever with snow. I'm like, I'm like a bull in China shop. Oh, I'm gonna, you, you will see something funny tonight. You excited, Rachel? Market is still here. Market's still on. You wanna try Glogi? Yeah, but let's have a look at the other store. The Christmas market in Tallinn, Estonia is famous for many reasons. It has been set up in Town Hall Square since 1441 and their Christmas tree is truly unique being the first Christmas tree ever to be put on display in Europe. It's known as one of the best Christmas markets in the world with every year more than half a million people visiting. I think it's perfect to come here at this late, at 8 o'clock. I mean, it's almost the, the closing time. The, uh, but you know, I, I can't see any shops that are closing. Less people, oh, actually there is one behind us. Look, this is Rachel's happy, happy zone. Happy face zone. Yeah, uh, look at this. I don't know if you can see where we are. I'll give you like a concept. This is where we are right now. Did you drop it? <laughs> oh no! How many times you got to drop? I'll eat it. You sure? Oh. oh my god! What a monster! Anyway. Okay, let's not keep dropping food. <sighs> This is big. I think this one is a more, maybe a normal Frankfurt. Mm. I'm sorry if I'm being disgusting with my runny nose. <laughs> but um, too delicious. Look at the view. It's so Look at our amazing. backdrop. I'll show you guys our backdrop what we're looking at right now look at that seriously look at that amazing amazing that's where we are right now mm. Estonia is amazing I love cycling oh. so good mm. okay. and you know what the best thing is you can get this bread for free mm. it's so good I love yeah. it and it's and yummy bread. I'm really getting addicted to that this bread dry bread is so yummy you must try it when you are in Estonia Oh, seriously, I want to bring it home. It's so good. The Christmas market in Estonia is definitely a must do. You have to do it in your life. It is just absolutely just beautiful. As we sit here with our nice hot food, it really is just like you're living a dream. This is like the kind of things that you wake up to. It's just absolutely amazing. I feel, I feel like I'm in a dream. I honestly do. Estonian Christmas. Oh my God. Just so beautiful. So pretty. Well, let me try the sausage. That's my leftover. Is it? Mmm, it's yummy. It's like a Kransky, very yummy sausage. Mm. Hey, let's let's try some gloggy. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Seems to be a popular one. Maybe that, the three euro thing too. Oh, that one too. Yeah, why not? Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. Uh, 
below this. Yes, uh, so this is normal, 14% alcohol, this is 21% alcohol with the Agarmeister and this is with Vanna Daglin's also 21% alcohol. This is like wow. stronger and this is normal. Oh. Okay, what's yours? I'll go for the strong one, why yeah. not? So you'll find a lot of different gloggy stands and the funny thing is is that there's a lot of different uh, types but they all pretty much remain the same price they're about the three to 350 euros and even if the alcohol is none or if the alcohol is a lot the price remains the same so it's pretty interesting because if that was happening somewhere in Australia I'm pretty sure the price would be double so yeah this one was 21% alcohol the other one was 8% and same cost so of course I went for the 21% why not mm, that's the Christmas spirit have a look just full of war warm goodness citrusy it's very citrusy with the of course the lemon in there I'm not too sure what the Estonian spirit is it's called Vanna Tallinn um, I'm gonna look it up later but yeah that is some strong stuff pretty hungry didn't have a dinner oh that looks really yummy that looks like a Dutch Dutch donut mm. Mm. Mini chocolate donut. Yeah. Nothing more, nothing less. That's what it is. <laughs> but it's really delicious. Really good. Yummy. Okay, what about the hot gloggy? Mm. <laughs> oh. This is strong. It's strong, isn't it? This is strong and hot. <laughs> it's really nice though, isn't it? It's like um, once it goes through my throat, it kind of warms my throat up. Mm. It is exactly a chocolate donut, but it is so delicious. And this cold temperature, nice warm food, warm gloggy. This is what Christmas is all about. So, so amazing. Magical. So this is our first Christmas market. Um, really delving in the culture of it and experiencing it. And it's so lovely. There's a big massive Christmas tree just behind me. We've got this nice beautiful cathedral church surrounded by all these market goods and just hot gloggy and all these treats and it's just it's so Christmassy you've got Christmas carols happening in the background it just really is magical it's just uh, I've never um, experienced a white Christmas before and to experience it is just really magical Thank you for watching guys, uh, we've met really lovely people in this market but unfortunately we couldn't film them because you know I feel a bit odd to take out the camera to oh can you say that again your story <laughs> that seems very disgraceful so I didn't film any of, the, any of this but we've met really really lovely people um, all over the world and uh, we'll see you next time, bye!